Hey, Hello. how are y'all doing? Hey, everybody. Good to see you guys. Hey, we want to talk a little bit tonight about overcoming fear. Yes, something that has been very, uh, well, everyone's life, but my life, my wife's life, mm -hmm. we've had to overcome fears. And that is something that as an entrepreneur, as a business person, as someone who has dreams and goals to do something, something you're going to all have to do. And so I wanted to share a little bit tonight. I've also wrote a blog about this here, but in this video blog, I wanted to share just a little bit about the whole concept about overcoming fear. Fear is something, <laughs> excuse me, that grips us all. It's something that actually challenges all of us at the deepest part in our hearts. And so it's something that we have to face and we have to face it head on because if you don't, it's gonna be something debilitating. It will set you back, it will keep you, and it'll drown you and keep you from reaching your fullest potential, what you've been called to do. And you don't want to do that. And that's absolutely right. You do not want to get derailed on what God's called you to do. And even my wife, um, something for her, she was gonna share a little bit about something that's been a fear for her and, and just to be able to encourage you in that. So for me personally, it started when I was very young and my, I think that I have two really, really big fear. First, I had fear of men, not men generally, but um, being in a relationship, being with... in a, in a intimate relationship mm, yes. with a man. And that was a big fear for me that I did overcome. I mean, my husband is approved on that, uh, but it was a journey, definitely. It was a very hard journey. And then my second fear that sometimes even now can come up, uh, and that is uh, to succeed in something that really doesn't matter or succeed in something that I'm actually not called to do or, uh, yeah, so that's, something that I, not daily, but it can come over me now and then. It's like, am I really doing and living out my fullest potential of my ability, my talent and my giftings? Because that's what I want to do. And my fear is that I succeed in something that, you know, I'm just good at. So I, I'll, I'll just do it because it's inside my comfort zone and I don't want to be in my comfort zone. I want to go out of my comfort zone and go for the things that I have talent and even dreams in, but maybe I haven't uh, come there yet. So I know I, know I need to work on my, my giftings and my talents. That's where I want to be. Absolutely. Thanks for sharing that. That's really something that we all have to do is is think is this something that is meaningful and it's something that's worth going after is what i've been called to do and make sure it is because if it's not then what's the point in the end for me personally i have definitely had a lot of fears that i've had to overcome and that still challenge me every now and then they'll sneak up and kind of rear its ugly head at me and just feel like Oh my gosh, I got to get that thing out of here. Yeah. Uh, but for what I've known for myself, I have come at me is the fear of having what it takes, especially for a man. I think in general, we have a thought that, hey, do I have what it takes? Can I actually do this and succeed and be successful in this venture? And that's something that I've had to, to face head on and be like, yes, yes, I do have what it takes and I can overcome this and I can move forward even if I don't feel it and that's a big part of it too with the fear is the emotion and not letting that rule you and one thing I, I think it was uh, John Wayne of all people I talked about it's not that you have the fear of of the getting on the horse it's the fear of um, you just have to overcome it basically the gist of it you just have to overcome it get back on the horse even if it's gonna buck you just do it anyways and that's kind of what you have to do with overcoming fears. Don't let the feeling overwhelm you. You have the truth and you have the knowledge and the know-how and it's about moving forward in that right direction. So guys, you can do this. You can yes. overcome the fear. There is a way through it and God is for you. And it says in the Bible, if God is for you, who can be against you? He is with you as the helper and he's your advocate 
and he will help you make a way to get to those things that you're called to do that he has destined you for because it's something that he has destined you to and that he wants you to succeed. He didn't Mm -hmm. create you to be a failure, to be a loser. He created you to overcome and to fulfill the destiny he's called you to. So be encouraged, guys. You guys are overcomers. You're more than conquerors and you'll make it. Yes, So just remember that and hope to see you guys soon and stay connected on our Facebook page again. We've got our page. Make sure you get on there and ignite your dreams. Um, We want to be able to promote that again too. And we also have an upcoming course here that's soon coming here. We're going to have eight weeks, ignite your dreams. And we want to be able to see you guys there. We're going to help equip you and get you ready to be able to do those things again that you've been called to do and to help face some of those fears and and find strategies to be able to do that. So make sure that you, you get on our website and you check it out there and we've got plenty of stuff coming down the pike here guys. Um, But stay tuned and we'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye. Bye.